Welcome to this edition of Burn Tech University presented by United States Stove Company. In today's video, we'll show you how to clean the exhaust in your pellet stove. This video can be used for the following models. Always refer to your owner's manual. This video is for informational purposes only. If you are unsure about replacing any of the components on the stove, we recommend having a certified electrician or stove technician do this for you. To start your project, you must first disconnect the power from the stove. The tools needed for today's project are a 7 16 socket, a ratchet, a 3 inch extension, 7 16 wrench, and a 5 16 socket driver. An ash vac, extension, and brush or cleaning tool will also be very helpful. To begin, use your socket driver to remove the back screw on the left side panel, the five screws on the back panel, and both screws holding the right side panel to the stove. Then lift the right side panel out away from the stove. Next, lift the back panel up and away from the stove. Now, disconnect the wires from the exhaust blower to the wiring harness. Create less mess by using a vacuum to remove debris from the exhaust outlet and surrounding areas. Using an attachment may make this task easier. To clean the exhaust duct weldment, you must remove the exhaust blower. Use your ratchet and wrench to remove all five nuts and bolts from the exhaust blower. Use your socket to loosen the bolts and wrench to hold the nuts in place. After the bolts have been removed, pull the exhaust blower away from the exhaust weldment. It is now the perfect time to check the blower gasket for any wear or tear. If there is, go ahead and replace it. The maintenance of the exhaust duct weldment is extremely important to the life and operation of your stove. This needs to be done every year before the burn season, and more often if a low grade fuel is being used. Use your vacuum to clean any debris from the exhaust duct weldment, taking special care to vacuum in the back of the weldment toward the stove. Also clean the fan blades on the exhaust blower and the housing using your vacuum and brush to loosen any hard to reach dust and dirt. Now that the exhaust blower and weldment are thoroughly clean, look over the inner components of the stove and vacuum any debris you missed earlier. Then, install the blower by holding it and the gasket into place. Replace and tighten the nuts and bolts removed earlier using the ratchet and wrench. Once complete, reconnect the two wire leads from the blower to the wiring harness. Put the back panel into place. Slip the left panel over the back panel. Then insert and tighten the screw holding the left panel to the stove. Then follow with the two screws holding the two panels together and the screw in the bottom center. Now insert the right side panel into the front of the unit and slide the back ledge over the back panel. Insert and tighten the four remaining screws. Now that your project is complete, reconnect power to the stove and check for proper operation. Once again, this video is for informational purposes only. We strongly recommend a certified electrician or stove technician do any repairs for you. If you have any additional questions or need further assistance, please call 1-800-750-2723 or visit us at usstove.com. Thank you for watching Burn Tech University.